Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's G from Happiness and Crafting. So it's Friday freebie day. We are on number 182. Now I have got like a little weekly planner for you to do, for you to do, for you today and a to-do list. Now I wanted to do this for me. Um, so I, well I did it for me and I thought you guys would love it as well. Um, so it's just like a weekly planner, which on Mondays, because I want to do I want to get a little bit more organized i'm not really organized i've not been a hundred percent this week so that's why i've not done the videos um i'm still i think i've got a virus or something that's um i picked up when i was in spain so um it's been a funnier week so i have managed to do this so i did a nice weekly planner um which is great because i want to put sort of like my videos down on here and what what videos i'm going to put on throughout the week um and like a little to-do list and i thought you guys would love it as well um because this like i said last week we're doing some random friday freebies this month um so this is what we've got and i'm loving it now i'm hoping you can see it um it's quite faint on here we've got this beautiful rose on there um i've got little sort of like spaces on here days of the week and then we've got like a nice little um rosy bit on the back um, which i am loving now these do fit into your journal so you can just cut that out and stick it into your journal onto a journal page um, or you can have them free on your desk or you can just write down things on there um, clip them together with one of these i'll show you what i've done in a minute how i've done it um, but i'm loving it i think it's really really nice because i just need something that i can just write down on quickly um so that's for the friday freebies now well, i've got something else as well for the kofi now this is for the one-off and my monthly supporters so this one obviously they go together this is a daily planner so this one i've got morning afternoon and evening if you've got things planned um and this is a schedule so we've got the date we've got the time and we have your task whatever you're going to be doing um, so if you're sort of like going to the dentist or anything, you can put your date, the time you're going um, and then just write dentist or shopping or anything like that. So I think that's really, really nice, really, really handy. Um, and then also for the, the um, Kofi, I've got a backing page. So if you want to back it, um, you can print that on the back as well. This one hasn't printed out very well. It's got little lines on it because my printer ink was on its way out um but i just think they're lovely so those two are for the kofi and this one is for our lovely friday freebies um and if you're not in um the facebook group because this is where you, you print it off from um please there's links down below so go on and join the group um, and then you can print these off as well so let's pop those to the side for a minute um this is how i've done it oh let me just show you oopsie daisy I've got two little sort of like tab things at the top um, and that's for these so again just in case you want to do these I've just added a little bit of extra one on each side of there um, because what I've made I've just made them into little tabs um, like that so they can be um, you know clipped together um, you could put little holes in here and pop it into a binder but I just thought this would look really nice and I've just held them together with um, a jump ring, a biggest jump ring, because the only ones I brought some of these little um, thingy majiggies um, clips together like that. But what they're way too big, they're way way too big for this. So I just thought I've got like a little little jump ring in there, which you can open up and um, add another page to it as well. But I just think that's why I printed on the back. I just think it looks really, really lovely. So nice and super simple this week. Um, so I'm going to just show you here. I've just already cut it out. And again, these are the little bits at the top. So what was I've got to do? I'm just going to ink those. Let's pop that over there. Now, let's get my scissors out. So these little bits, now I have printed on the back, so if you print on the back, you probably won't need these, you could just use another little bit. But if you don't print on the back, you can have these little bits, which make into little tabs, which I think are great. Um, so 
if I get enough of these pages then I'll probably make a little binder um, a little um, one and then I can pop um, the little jump ring things on there so that's one but yes no videos this week guys I do apologize but um, I've been up and down here but because I've got my back it's still not a hundred percent I have you know it's not easy to sit down as you know you guys um, have bad backs as well um, but we have been doing lots of walking on the beach um, which has helped a lot but just not feeling you know when you just don't feel right um, I'm just haven't since I've been back from Spain I just haven't felt myself um, we I did go to the doctors and he's got a little bit of high blood pressure so we sound a right old messy pair don't we so um, we're trying to be having a little bit of self-care this week um, but the weather's been beautiful so we've been out trying to sort of like have little walks and stuff okay so I've just cut those into four and then what I'm going to do I'm just going to pop two of them back together again like that um, and then I'm going to just round the edge just on my little one here I can so I've been working a little bit in my um, shabadashery journal but not a lot um, so I will get back to it I'm sure I will feel better this week over the weekend and get back into making a few videos get things back going again I haven't lost my mojo because um, I want to do so many things but I just can't I just can't do it I just don't feel well enough to do it um, but I'm sure I will get there right so that's your four little tabs what I'm going to do I'm just going to just ink around them a little bit just with our good old trusty um, vintage photo ink I did find I was having a little route through my drawer to see if I've got any spare bits and pieces and I've got one of these spare in there so I was really pleased about that I normally do try and buy two at a time um, I don't know what date this one is May 23 so I do write the date on there when I when I use it when I buy it or open it so that's not quite a year yet is it so they do last a nice long time I don't seem to get on very well with the reinkers to re-ink it I don't know I think I just like to buy a new one when they've dried out I don't find the re-inkers um, work too well for me right I'm just going to go around this just with a little bit of ink just to get rid of those little white edges like that so this would be good if you didn't want to put the little um, like ring binder bits on just uh, if you've got one of those little clips you could just sort of like clip it at the top you know those boards with the clips on you could just print off a few of these and clip it on couldn't you I'm sure I've got one somewhere I think I bought one to sort of um, decorate I'm sure it's in the depths of my craft room somewhere okay, just ink around the edge so this is a to-do list this is definitely what I need so loving those um, loving the little things I think they'll go into any sort of like shabby journal won't they and they can print let me just show you I think it should fit on a page I hope so yeah look at that you can just put that on a page oh look that's a little flip out actually that would be quite nice wouldn't it you could pop that on like a little flip out like that that's quite a nice idea 
little to-do list or your little weekly planner on there so you've still got a page and have a little flip out all sorts of things but yeah you can pop these into any of your books but I just quite like the little idea of having them as little um, in a ring binder so what I'm going to do is just fold these little bits in half like this like that and then I'm just going to glue them on to the pages and then punch a hole in them so let's just pop that on like that perfect so let's just I'm gonna have that upside down now what I did on this one it's sort of on the second little hole there and on the third little tick one on there so I suppose actually I want them to all fit don't I so let me just take this off so I've just got these are just like little just a little jump ring these are quite nice sort of like thick ones which will come on and off but obviously I want them all to fit together so what I did let's just take one of them I put this one underneath made sure they're up the right way like that just so that we know that they're together and even I'm going to clip that on there clip that on there so we know that they're not going to move and then what I will do I will glue this like that and then so this lines up if you can see so we're going to line that up with that and glue that down so we know that that's going to be in exactly the same place so let's just get my glue a little bit of glue on there you can see that this is to full up so you can tell that I haven't been working because I do get through lots and lots of glue oopsie daisy let's pop that on there just take that and just push that underneath like that and just line those up perfect like that so we know that one's in the right place glue that on because they've all got to be in the right place so we're not going to fit are they so let's just lift that up pop that on line it up with that bottom one and then squeeze that down Take these off and then I'm going to pop this one on top and we can do that one as well. I've got them upside down because I'm working from this side and I find it easier that way. So let's just clip that on there, clip that on there and then with a little bit of glue. You could probably just make a hole in these ones as well if you didn't want to do this. But I just think these look quite nice, don't they? As little sort of like tabs that come out. Pop that underneath. Line that up. Stick that down. Perfect. Actually, don't glue everything together. Oops. There we go. Well, I hope you guys have had a lovely week, busy week. We had a beautiful walk on the beach this morning, and then this afternoon it actually poured with rain. So our weather at the moment is very up and down. I think it is everywhere actually this time of year, isn't it? Not quite sure what it's doing there we go. right that's stuck down nicely perfect so now I'm going to pop that one on top like that because what we need to do is go through these holes to make sure 
Let me do this. Oopsie. Oops, that just pinged on my into my bin, I think. Okay. Now I've used the bigger one on our oops, little crocodile here. Let me just. It's got some paper stuck in there. There we go. Take that, and I'm just going to go through that little hole just over the top. Oops, there we go. Just so we know it's in the right place. Perfect, there we go, lovely. And then we have two to-do lists and a weekly planner. So you can make up lots of these, just print them off like that. See, look, they're in exactly the same place and I just think these will look really, really nice. This then can go onto here. Now again, you can decorate them if you want to, um, but I don't think you need to. But if you wanted to pop a little bit of sort of ribbon or something, you can. Now the jump rings I am using, shall I try and measure it? Ow, ow. Oops. This is, let's have a look. This is a millimeter. Oh, I think that's probably about half an inch. No, quarter of an inch, sorry. Just over quarter of an inch. So that's how big they are. They're the biggest ones that I've got. So just open up. But I think they're just, you know, perfect for these, aren't they? And just do that up. And they're thick enough. So you could hang a little bit of ribbon on there. Or you could attach a little bit of ribbon on there as well. Through the little holes if you don't have jump rings. Um, and I just think that's perfect, isn't it? To pop on your desk as a little weekly planner to-do list like that so i'm loving it so i hope you do too i hope you'll give it a go and making it again you can stick them into your journals um you can um put them onto one of those little clipboards or just have them in a lip print couple off and just have them beside you on your desk just to write on so there we go guys that is your friday freebie so it's going to come to you like this again just print it off you can print anything on the back um, or you don't have to put anything these are the little tabs that you can make and again for my lovely Kofi supporters one off and monthly supporters this is what you're going to get a daily planner a schedule and also a backing paper as well so this is fabulous because this will just go into your journal as a journal page as well um, which is lovely but again my print is not doing too good um, i need to go and change the ink on that so there we go guys pop over to the facebook group um, and print this off whether you're going to use it now or not make sure you get it because the friday freebies aren't always in there um so um and if you're not on in um on facebook these will eventually all of my friday freebies will be um on kofi in my kofi shop or in my etsy shop at a really minimum fee you know only to cover the costs of etsy that's the only way you can get through get them <coughs> excuse me so okay guys we'll have a lovely lovely weekend uh, Please take care, stay safe, and I will see you soon. All right, guys, bye-bye.